As the doors slowly opened, a twitching man appeared in front of them. He reached out and grabbed the boy's shirt, just as the boy was about to be pulled out. In times of crisis, the mother arrived in time, rushing up and pouncing on the man. The siblings were beyond horrified, but their mother was also drenched by the rain. Soon the whole body began to twitch, obviously infected with a virus. The mother then collapsed to the ground. The siblings had no choice but to return to the bunker, press the button to close the door. At this time, the mother's screams kept coming. The siblings sat down and blamed themselves. As time passes day by day, there is still no news of their father. The signal of the cell phone is also not. This bunker has also become a place for them to survive, and is also a prison for them. A few days later, sister accidentally found on the tablet. There are bunkers just like them out there. She tried to make contact with other bunkers. Maybe she can still find her father, but after trying for half a day, no results at all. The hope that had just been raised was dashed again. The sister is undeterred. She thought there must be other equipment in the bunker to contact the outside world. Soon they found a mysterious toolbox. Open it and see. This actually contains a set of wireless communication equipment. Ecstatic. She did reach out to